All right, we got a lot of stuff to do. Thankfully, you did save, I think. Right, right. We let's hope, let's hope. Yeah, Margrave Henkel's house. One lousy actor, sure, whatever you say, buddy. Let's start doing the. Excuse me, I clicked on the quest. Gangs of Novigrad. I would like to do that. Got a minute. He does, but he's got nothing for me. Gothic. Excuse, 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 excuse. What, 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 what's going on? Goodbye. I'm out of here. See you never. All right. So apparently, I gotta meet him like right over here. Might as well do that then. I do love the Gwent music. I like rain. Keeps the rogues indoors. Keeps the roads indoors? Keeps the rogues indoors? Okay, that makes more sense. Be down there. Out of the way, please. Hello, Cleaver. That's not Cleaver. What's going on here? Sorry, sorry. It's just that you got some stuff here that uh, I'm wanting, you know, like some water. Old goat hide. Alcohol, yeah, yeah. A book on Kovir. Nothing, nothing else really. So whatever. That's worth like a few, you know, a few items, something. So apparently, you are down here. Nope. Take that dumpling. Okay, where is this line taking me? It's telling me to go here. And all the way around. What a dump. Oh? Looks more like a beggar's hovel than a Margrave's townhouse. Dandelion made some interesting friends. If this is the... Why would I not all... What? I was doing this quest. What the hell is going on? Something, something real messed up happened. I, okay, I am supposed to go through here to get to Cleaver. Apparently, okay, Cleaver is here. Apparent. Okay, so there's that. Your henchman is like sick or whatever. Don't know nothing about no heist. Hello. You beating someone up? Yeah. Yep. A wee minute, Witcher. Mm -hmm. Now, I'm curious something mighty. How is it you were off the same bloody night horse and tried to kill me? It was chance honest. I was at the brothel. I've witnesses. I don't doubt you found some witnesses, but I do doubt the bit about chance. Hmm. Know what? Shite conversation this. So much blethering, we've got nowhere. Is he gonna just kill him? Led, you have a chat with him. It's simple. I wanna know where Horson is. I've not betrayed you! Not ever! Oh, well. No! No! I know nothing! I don't think these two dwarves care. Alright, what's up? Help me find Junior. I'm about to send my lads around Horson's hideouts. Won't say no to a witch's blade. Lead my men, take the water Junior, and drag him out of his hidey hole. Win win situation, as I see it. Hmm. Horson can't die. I gotta ask him questions. Horson can't die until I've talked to him. My lads are hot-headed and I like him like that. Wanna rein them in? Do so on your own. Alright, I'll help him. Why not? It's a right. side mission. Now, I suspect Junior's hiding at his casino in Gildorf. Either that or near the arena beneath the bits. My lads will be there. Find him. Okay. 
Meet the dwarves. You don't have to go there anyway, but I have to do it silently. What the hell? This is, this is an option, right? Either go like hard and in, just like try and murder everyone and get information. Or you can go the more silent way, like Drikshta ones. I really hope this doesn't lock me out of... Bro. Freaking chair traps, man. I hope this, this doesn't uh, lock me out of the... The silent way to do things. Because I would like to do it like that. Mine stone. That's, that's important. Okay, apparently... Search Margrave Henkel's house using a witcher senses. Solve this, this place. Hello. Mm -hmm. Why have we come here? What is the why? Why? Oh, because the guy was supposed to be dead, but he visited the place where the bomb was put. Right, right, right. Silver cylinder. Hmm. Bottom looks like what I found in the sewer. All right, well, that's pretty damning evidence. Okay, it's a vent up, obviously. We'll look around, though. You never know what you'll find. Some good books. Sign of someone educated, obviously, big house. Okay, for your sword. Did not go this way, so should check this way first. Okay, there's the bottles, not spikes. Now oh, this is a freaking spike trap room. No, it's just it's just a bunch of it's a winery. A letter and a bottle, the hmm. wine from your birth year. It's absolutely excellent, startling bouquet. You absolutely must try it. But afterwards, please place the bottle back where you found it. Your birth year. Could be dandelions or series. Hmm. Mm, it'll be in inventory. Just press I. There you go. Uh, note, note, no. There it is. Mysterious note. The wine from your birth here. It's simply brilliant, startling bouquet. You absolutely must try it. But afterwards, please place the bottle back where you found it. With love from D. From D is dandelion, bottle of wine. Saw the riddle from the mysterious note. Okay, so I guess we gotta put it in here. 1251 vintage. How do I know it's 1251? How do I know it's 1251? What do you mean, sort of the 1251? <laughs> Old wine from Toussaint. Okay, I mean, whatever, sure. Slot it in. 1245 to 1254. Mm-hmm. Satisfying click in the next room over, I think. Not really a very difficult puzzle, I suppose, but I guess Secret what it room. is. Hmm. Probably where Dandelion and his cohorts planned the heist. The wild hunt. Instructions on how to build a bomb. Hmm. Signed by one Kalkstein. He was asking after Kalkstein, remember? Okay, from one of the women. Sugar. And lumps of a substance dipped in wyvern oil. Hmm. Potassium. Looks like they made the bomb here. Alright. Stain. Wyvern oil. Okay, so they bought the ingredients here as well. For a look at that note, hunting gauntlets. And that's the north. Letter from Doodoo. -doo. What the heck? 
Siri, Menge is following me. He has seized the treasure. He has dandelion. Menge. You must flee. Footsteps. Not good. Wait, who the hell was Menge? Dude, I'm so bad with names. Siri, if you are reading these words, that means you have solved my riddle, for which you have my congratulations. It also means you have not yet been caught and you are still a newbie grad, which worries me greatly. I do not know exactly what you did on Temple Isles, but Menge is furious and will not rest until he captures you, skins you alive and burns you at the stake. And now that he's got his sacrimonious paws on Driksha's treasure... Oh, so I think Menge was the, the freaking religious dude. The leader of the religious people. The freaking uh, eternal fire church person he can hire enough men to search every home in the city thrice over i am a doppler so i will be able to hide but you you must flee while you still can yours do do p.s don't ever think don't even think about breaking don't even blah, don't even think about trying to break dandelion free from menge's clutches it's impossible but knowing our friend he'll wriggle his way out somehow or at least i hope he will PPS, forgive me for not writing how to contact me, but A, you are to flee, remember? B, Melitele guards those who guard themselves. Alright. Is was this an ambu no doo doo beeper vent. Okay, so we got a thing on him. Geralt and I had known the Doppler doo doo for years, from before the moment we actually we had actually first we had actually met him in fact. You see we were unwittingly talk we unwittingly blah. I am horrible at reading, apparently. You see, we unwittingly talked to him when he was in Novigrad, impersonating another friend of mine, a halfling merchant named Dainty Bibbervert. Dudu has had assumed Dainty's form to use the merchant's network of contacts for some business endeavors of his own. Dainty was infuriated at first at his inability to locate the imposter who had asserted himself into his dealings, but when Dudu's investments began generating sizable returns, the halfling changed his tunes. He took the Doppler on as a partner, introducing him to everyone as his cousin, Dudu Bieberwelt. Siri, Dudu and I had all embroiled ourselves in quite the fiasco, but unlike me, the Doppler was not caught by the Temple Guard. Alright, so now we know confirmation he was caught by the Temple Guard. Alright, who's attacking me? And Triss. Huh. I have a word with Dixta. Didn't expect to see you here. Certainly not with Triss. I decided we could use someone who knows a bit of magic. The runes on the bomb. I'm absolutely dying to know what they mean. You dying to know too, Triss? No, just here for the coin. Ah, Makes sense. Marigold playing the cynical materialist. I love it. In truth, her ideals brought Triss here. She needs gold to save her colleagues. When I recover my treasure, I'll be in a position to help her. Simple as that. Speaking of which, and pardon my Beauchelet was, have you found out who fucking nicked my gold? Why do you come here though, yeah. Hang on, gotta tell me why you're here first. We agreed. If I learned anything, I'd take it to you. So we did, but I was concerned about you. Stop by to see if everything was all right. Uh-huh, you don't trust me. Bullshit. You don't trust me. I trust you as much as you trust me. Not at all. Hmm. Believe me, it's a healthy relationship. Gentlemen, really feel privileged to witness your battle of wits. But try to remember, unlike you, I put my life at risk every time I venture out into the streets. Did the same just coming here. So I beg you, can we get to the point? Right, right, right. All signs point to Menge. Bothered Triss for nothing. No point examining the bomb. Because? Because I already know who nabbed your treasure. Commander of the Temple Guard, Caleb Menge. Well, well, Marigold. Your coin stands to come with a side of revenge. Geralt, would you be kind enough to tell me what you've learned? I'm terribly curious. Margrave Henkel told me everything doesn't matter. Hmm... I never spoke to Margaret Henkel. I read a note. Wait, what? Henkel told me. Old man's alive and well. Faked oh. his own death to escape his creditors. Strange. I had no idea he was in debt. He was. 
and Menga promised to take care of things in exchange for help with the heist, so... Geralt, how can I put this delicately? Bollocks. Hmm. If you thought I'd fall for that tale you just pulled out of your ass, you don't know me one bit. I know you care about results. Know you well enough to know what matters. Results. So I lied. Still say I can lead you to your treasure. Forgive me, Geralt, but after what you just pulled, I'd sooner believe a whore who proclaimed her undying love. Fair. Would you believe a sorceress who stands to gain if you get your coin back? Perhaps. I'd still prefer the whore, though. You're hiding something, and that's one thing I can't stand. Even more than Nilfgaard. But ultimately, this is a business deal, not a marriage. Besides, there must be some truth in all those lies. You're too dense to make it all up on your own. Hey. Mm. Menger has been spending heaps of coin lately. Though to my knowledge, he shouldn't have a copper to his name. So, what now? From what I've heard, Menger spends his nights at the docks, witch hunter's quarters. Maybe pay him a visit. Ask where he's holding my gold for me. Hmm. While you sit here twiddling your drums? Mm hmm So we do your dirty work while you sit around twiddling your thumbs. Darling, when I'm able to make use of someone, I always do. It's convenient. And safe. Come on, admit you're scared of Menger. Of course I'm scared, bloody dangerous horse son. Triss would concur, I think. Not in those words. But I do agree with the statement overall. Right, right. Doubt Menger will admit anything willingly. As do I. Lucky I hired a witcher and a sorceress who've been through so much together to get this done. What's our past got to do with it? A great deal. Lovers will jump into the abyss for one another. Suits my needs perfectly. Namely, it greatly increases your chances of getting out of the hunter's barracks alive. With my treasure. Teresa, you're using us. Let's not say that in, in other the past. Words, you're using us. Using I didn't you? deny it. Never. Merely making the most of your mutual bond. <laughs> well, lovebirds, I really must be going. Good luck. Let's not deny it outright. She's Thought still happy. You'd correct him. Say that we, you know. You didn't say anything either. Yeah. Could have corrected him yourself. True. But it's not an easy thing to say, is it? But we've strayed from our topic. Got a treasure to recover. Triss, gotta tell you something. Dijkstra's gold, it's the last thing I care about. Mm -hmm. Thought as much. This is about Siri, isn't it? Yep. Mm -hmm. Menga's got Dandelion locked up somewhere. And Dandelion saw Siri. That changes everything. Listen, meet me at midnight by the Chapel of the Eternal Fire, east of the harbor. We'll figure out a way to get into the hunter's barracks together. All right. See you then. And thanks. All right. Count Reuben's treasure. Meet Trace at the Eternal Fire Shrine near the harbor at midnight. Well, it's 4 p.m. right now. No, Nowhere near midnight. You know, you say you take a risk coming onto the street. Why don't you just freaking teleport then, You must sweat lady. like a swine in that jacket. Is it pretty? Uh, no, not really. Doesn't seem that hot, honestly. Even with the. Uh... Oh, hey, Vivaldi. How can I be of service? Can I sell you stuff? No. Okay. Till oh wait, 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 wait! No, no, no! Yeah, yeah, yeah. How can I be of service? Convert some currency. Got some coin? I'd like to convert into crowns. You've come to the right place. A better rate you'll not find anywhere in the city. Done. 219 crowns. Easy peasy. Good money. Every man for himself. Hello, armorer. Top notch swords. Not really, but uh, show me your wares. Show me what you have in stock. You have a lot, right? He's got a lot of money. There you go. It's all good. And sell him. I should not have sold that. Okay, well, whatever. I did it. <laughs> Okay, should not sell that either. Gotta be careful. So long. A lot of these things now are much higher level. They're gonna be better than even freaking the Griffin stuff. The Sad but true. Top notch swords. 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. Craft something for me? Willing to craft something for me? That's why he's here. But I really don't want him to craft. Just repair all my equipped items. Farewell. So long. That's all I really wanted. Okay. So we can go there at midnight. That's still the time to go. So we have gangs of Novigrad. When Geralt entered. Okay. Uh, yeah, but the, this one. Find, find, visit. I don't know, man. Fencing lessons. Can I do this? Move on. Can I not do this yet? Go to the van after residence tomorrow to give Rosa fencing lessons? I thought it is tomorrow. Isn't it? <laughs> is it not tomorrow already? I guess not. Uh, I mean, I could definitely do all of these now. Ruins of S. Tayer. Explore passages under temple aisles. Find all the diagrams of cat school. There's wolf school gear under care morn. Fencing lessons, there's gangs of Novigrad, Black Pearl, Defender of the Faith is still there. I guess we'll just do this. Find Horson Jr.'s hideout, Casino Arena. So one of them is his house, right? Casino, Arena, hideout. Let's see. You've seen the new waitresses. Okay, the horse is stuck somewhere in there. We'll keep walking. Temple Isles is uh, somewhere around there. Ray, I guess. Right, is the bridge usable? Oh, it is. Okay, well, what am I waiting for? Okay, get down from there, horse. Fresh St. Gregory's Bridge. Ah. Oh. Oh. It's a bridge. How do you lose your way to the bridge? <laughs> It's literally just one road. Honestly, I'm off the horse. There's too much stuff to see around here, man. It takes a great deal of arrogance to call a fire salvation from sin. Oh, yeah, I agree. After the late discussion, get them here and only here. They look Nilfgaardian. Hmm. Fashion has come from the south. Soon everything will look Nilfgaardian. Know why? Because this will be a Nilfgaardian city. Greetings. He says so. I don't think he minds. Don't you fear the pyre, Freedom? Nope. The pyre fears me, honestly. What the heck is going on down here? People are praying. This is a shrine, I suppose. What a place, man. Look at all these walkways. Leading down to the docks. All right, all right. You know, Mr. Menga. You don't. You seem well. I know, Mr. Menga. I'm probably gonna kill him. It's in a bit of time. But ah! we shall see. Clumsy, clumsy. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Out of the way. Ah. He would only walk normally. Ah. Out of the way, everyone. Witcher walking by. Cleaver. Hello, Cleavers. I hired the Witcher as my debt collector. The Eternal Fire. Geralt the Red. You already killed everyone. Hmm. I'd expect teeth to go up my ass before I'd expect to find Horson hiding in his house. Cleaver said to be thorough, so we look everywhere. Not to burn the corpses, though. Else for rats who congregate to feast. Hmm. We bit busy, mate. 
Yeah, I can see that. Oh, there's a book here. Dwarves were thorough as debt collectors. Didn't leave a scrap. Hmm. Seems to me I've heard of you before, right Fencing lessons. Oh, there you go. It's time. Okay, well, I'll check out the thoughts and I'll go to fencing lessons. But that, I wanted to do that. Because it seems like it seems like a time time limited quest, but I don't know. Maybe it is, maybe it isn't. Weaver's hench dwarf. Because they're not henchmen. Seems to me I've heard of you before, right? Of course you have. I'm famous. Doppler? Nothing interesting here. If I hadn't spoken to him, would these people not be dead right now? Place has been scrubbed clean. Hmm. So I guess he was prepared for people coming over to his house. And he cleaned it too. Just in case. Oh wow. A mine's like war. Never know when they're done for. Uh-huh. Mines like war. Although right now you're not doing mining, you're killing people. A lot of people. Although once again, a lot of criminals probably. All working for Menge, not Menge, for uh, the Cleaver, not the Cleaver, the Horse Sun. There you go. Keep forgetting names. And lots of stuff here. Alright, nothing else going on. So, nothing at his house. At least we have that confirmed. Have a hard time fighting the walk here, watch out. Was the dwarves who caught Snow White's cherry? Fuck, sure, blame that on us too. Snow White's cherry. Wow, oh, okay. I guess, yeah, dwarves are real in this world, so. <laughs> Maybe Snow White story also is real? Who knows? Alright, we gotta do fencing lessons. I wanna do that for, you know. Tell the guard captain about fencing lessons. No, the thieves, fools, and murderers. They're all the easy to find witches already, and I could use a quickie. Good. Out of the way. For fresh fish. Watch this. Fresh fish. You call this fresh with his googly eyes and, and those gills. Eternal flame will burn away our sins. Fishermen fear the deep seas with Skellige savages venturing further and further from their poxy isles. And the black ones are always eager for any fresh catch they happen upon. Hmm. So I have some gutter fish. Oh. When will the next witch burn, I wonder? Eh, uh, maybe never. Take good care of yourself. Thank you. Unless that's supposed to be like a bad thing, an insult. Hello, of Van Archery Guard, Captain. Greetings. You here for a specific reason? Yes. You to meet Rosa. Got a meeting with Rosa. A fencing lesson. Geralt of Rivia, yes? Yes. Miss Rosa stepped out for a walk near Temple Bridge, she said. She asked that you join her. Guess All it's right. going to be an interesting lesson. Thanks. All right, this way. Maybe she wants to go fight some thugs and <laughs> want some backup. This is not a rich part of town, is it anymore? Yeah, this is the bits. You're all the way out there. You sure that's safe? <laughs> For one like you. What will become of us under Radovid? Eternal fire. Oh, it's a war veteran. Eternal fire. Yeah, yeah, eternal fire, eternal fire, whatever. <laughs> Finally, Roach made his way here. 
All right, I gotta go meet with Rosa. What the hell is going on here? Who are you? Just a refuge? You're just a refuge. Alright. Oh, they give us a quest? Are they trying to kill him or something? Do I have to stop them? Nope. Alright, your fencing lesson is out here. In a very poor part of town. This is the bridge. This is the bridge. Yeah, over here. <laughs> oh, you do have a guard with you at very, at the very least. Nelf Guardian Regiment always accompany you on your walks. Always, Papa's orders. It's for your protection, Rosa dear. People here hate us. Why? What have I done to them? But enough about that. Soldier, you may leave. But His Excellency Ambassador Bar Atra said that. And this Excellency is telling you otherwise. Do you not recognize him? This is Geralt of Rivia. The best swordsman the North has ever seen. I'm safe with him. Mm -hmm. Now march off, quickly. Left, right, left, right. <laughs> yes, yes, left, right. Finally. Let's go, Geralt. I have something I wish to show you. Mm. What about training? We were supposed to train, not go for a walk. I know, Geralt. Now stop harping on about it and let's go. Hmm. What are you using me for? <laughs> oh, hello, Cleaver. Follow Rosa. All right, let's let's go. Now we can walk or we can run. We'll, we'll run. Oh, okay, stop. Stop the mouse going all crazy on me. Oh, okay. In the middle of the bridge. Here. You see, I thought that instead of training in a dank old cellar, we'd move around in the open air. A duel on a bridge, like in the novels. Now draw your sword. Only got my steel and silver swords. Hmm. We should be fighting with practice weapons. We should, but you of all people ought to know. There's much more fun in doing things you shouldn't. I'd rather not hurt you. Listen, I'd really rather not hurt you. Stop patronizing me, or you'll be the one to get hurt. Now on guard. Do I really have a stabber? Alright. Oh, yep. You all right? Yes. The only thing you've really hurt is my pride. Hmm. Rather interested in fencing. By the way, how do you get interested in fencing? I was bored. I've no friends here. Papa keeps me on a short lead. It's banquet after banquet after banquet. I detest banquets. Who doesn't really? <laughs> Boring conversations, terrible food, and weak booze. Exactly. At least with a sword in hand, I can have some fun. You know, blow off steam. All right, what now? All right, what's next? We should return. Just forgive me, Geralt. I know this might sound awkward, but would you mind turning around for a moment? Uh, no. My corset's shifted. It's pinching me terribly. Geralt, this is a trap. I can understand a woman wanting to look pretty, but fighting in a corset, it slows you. Rosa? Yep, as Shit, expected. She ran off. Anything happens to her, Varatra will kill me. Need to find her. Thankfully, I am a witcher. Can't yep, be far. Seven cats is this way. Great. Girl just wants to have fun. Hmm. Wonderful. Right, I, I see the tracks.
far from home, aren't you, sweetie? And there's no telling if you'll ever get back. She's Ambassador Varnatra's daughter. She's got diplomatic immunity. I don't really understand the shot you're saying. Now it's clear you love your black ones. It's no surprise, Lucas. Witches are drawn to monsters just the way things are. But this beastie... Oh, we didn't say we were ourselves. Take this coin. <laughs> Apologize. I don't have any delusion, eh? You leave it alone, piss off. Let me rephrase. Put it in words you'll understand. Piss off. I don't mind killing them. I'm not giving well, them 50 well. orans. It's not just black ones who tell us what to do. It's witches as well. Too bad I listen to neither. Get him, Lucas! Uh-huh. Yep, no chance. Why do people have to fight witches? I have no idea. Understand now why your father insists soldiers follow you around? So they can save you, as you did. Mm-hmm, great. No, so you won't need saving to begin with. Rosa, those humans died because of you. What of it? Do you expect me to shed a tear? Observe a minute of silence? They were dregs, they got what they deserved. Great. And you wonder why the North Hills hates Nilfgaard. The uh, lesson's over. Lesson's over. Remember what you've learned today. Looks like you'll be using that sword often. It's beyond me, Geralt. I don't understand you. Why concern yourself with the fate of two drunkards? The world would be a better place without... You should go home now. And take the shortest. Not the scenic route. We should, like, escort her home, at least. I understand. Farewell, Geralt. And good luck on the path. That's done. Fencing lessons, right? Quest completed. Fencing lessons. Don't even get paid for it, do we? Guards. No cards. Alright. Uh I don't really have any more quests to do at my level. We have the gangs of Novigrad, obviously. And then we can do this, Mitris and the at the Eternal Shrine near the harbor around midnight, but it's not midnight yet. I guess all we gotta do is just this mission. Maybe I should have paid them instead of fighting to kill them. Maybe that would have advanced the plot more instead of just kind of ending it. Out of the way, people. Come on. Well, he got a storm, so be happy. Ah, world will burn. Good, good. Oh, hello. Mages, yes, of course. Mages caused the rain. This is the casino. I should, I should go to the casino. Now his boys are gonna be here as well. Cleaver send you. I he did. Awaiting your word. Stay here. Not just yet. You're in charge. Give me a second. Alright, alright. So I think we can just do it the easy way, right? Maybe we can do it the easy way, find out the intel, and then... Wh 
what, what? You look familiar. What the hell, someone just died? Certificate? Let it hereby be known that the bearer of this document is entitled to fight in the ring under the name of Zendek. How did he die? I never even saw what happened. He got struck by lightning. Anyway, I'm gonna go to the uh, to the uh, casino first. What do you mean? Why are you even here? Same reason anyone comes here. Play a bit, have a good time. Yeah. Invite only, mate. Shit's out of luck. Two hundred dollars. Make a deal. Think we can make a deal? Hear that? Another one. Mhm. Mm no, we don't make deals. How much? Boy, remember what I told you? Were to be polite, like. Just my patience. Running a bit thin. We don't want your coin. We don't want anything else. On your way before we get plowing angry. Stop being all nice. Hanging a man like shit around the buckle. Aww. Is there any other way in? There has to be a way in. 200 orange? Come on. Oh, here's the loan shark. Can't go in there. Delusion or going in over your dead bodies. Uh. Tough luck. Fair enough. I found the arena, the casino. I can't get in though. What she cried. Oi, cocker. So yeah, I guess we gotta fight all of these guys. Other than that, we can just use delusion to get in. I think that's like uh, that's a one of these, one of these probably. Fire preaching art, melt armor, glyphs, exploding shield, delusion. Target does not move towards Geralt while he's casting Axie. Also, Axie in dialogues. Yeah, so here we got delusion. Okay. If only I could like take off some points and put it inside in that instead. Is there any delusion too? I mean delusion would help me in a lot of situations. Cause I think he's not in the casino, probably. Fucking hey, oars. Do I have a potion to reset everything? Or something like that? I think I did. Tony Owl lowers required level of all items by two temporarily. Okay, don't want that. Okay, what about alchemy? Potions. Time slows down. Darkness. Immunity to all potions. Vitality regeneration. Tony Owl. Thunderbolt. Full Moon, Golden Oriole, Killer Whale, Marabou, okay, extended duration, poisons now heal instead of doing damage, clear toxicity, restore vitality, that's all the potions, okay, what about decoctions, any stamina applies a buff, provides complete resistance, all alchemy creations, can be used one additional times. Critical hit damage. Mm. Increases the weight. That's pretty good. Sign intensity. Combine various attacks. Each flow damage. Critical hit. Mounted combat damage. Merit of fast travel. Increase uh, uh, damage is taken against Wraith. Attack power is increased. 
<sighs> yeah, nothing. I want to reset my skill points. I thought I had something for that. I can make alcohest. I can make a white gull. Or now I could just fight. I could just take Horson's men and get in there. Let's go to the arena instead. Because again, I would like to get into the casino. What do you mean? Greetings. Don't know you. Not letting you in. And don't you fucking stand there. Mm, my name is Zendek. Recognize this piece of paper? It's a hospital. Uh, fight contract. Good, you can read. So who's this contract made out to? It says, uh, Zdenek. Made out to Zdenek. Zdenek. Mm -hmm. I'm Zdenek. Any more questions? Uh, in you go. Mm -hmm. Don't you go wandering. Straight to Eagle now. Fair enough. All right, I'm in. This now, this not might, this might not be the way I would want to do it normally. Come on, get ready. Your turn now. I am ready. Uh, losers get paid a little. <laughs> losers get carted off to the cemetery. <laughs> Fight to the death. Oh. Hello, bandit. Shut up, boss munch. Dog can. <laughs> you look you awful. that madman wanted a sail to scale in these days. Oi! Uh huh. Remember our deal? Oh, you look at me. Oh, sorry. Oh. You need to hold on for a moment. I'll oh, hold on, right? And then. Oh, God, the ass munch. Uh, they're fighting dirty. <laughs> <laughs> Ah, ah. Good, they don't care about me grabbing some stuff. Captured and displayed in the sideshow of the circus. Well, it could be quite profitable. Stop staring, you'll jinx our work. Not your turn. Asian coin. That's it. We agreed on more. Take it yeah. while I'm giving you. Haven't I? No, I have not been here. I've been to a place like this, though. Oh, oh, yes. A beast. A beast. Okay, rich people. Orson says, man. The second sword. Is it in case the first one breaks? No. All right, so he's it's not the guy I want. He's just he's just some rich guy. <laughs> All right, I'm fighting. On the guards. Hello, Igor. Nice dog you got. I need work. What can you do? Good with a sword. Wouldn't scoff at working as protection. Hmm. And who here would you protect? Someone's got to keep folk in check. Crowds can spin out of control. Somebody's got to keep Kill! in peace. Kill! Mm. Claim any kind of experience. Done my share of fighting. Yeah. Done my share of fighting. Wouldn't carry Kill! a sword if I didn't know how to use it. Have you killed humans? Oh, yeah. Sometimes. Why not come out and say you're a witcher? It's plain to see. Not looking for any monster contracts. Need a regular Kill! job for a while. Mm, I'll have to test you. I want to see how you're managing a fight, if you can fight at all. You shall fight in the arena. Sure. Survive three bouts, and I'll keep it to work. Kill! All right, sure. Set me up. Already have. Shall we start right away, or do you need time to prepare? Well, I'm ready. Kill! Always prepared. Kill! Excellent. Let's see what you're worth. Remember, you fight to the death. 
The crowd doesn't take kindly to those who spare their foes. Kill! Kill! Let's do this. Are these thugs I'm fighting? Because I don't mind murdering thugs. Anyway. Ready your purses! Betting is open! From the far east, where a man's life is worth less than a cup of water. Paris. A a murderous mutant. His opponent, Gustav Rose. Oh, come on. A man who oh, can cut his way oh, out of his mother's oh, womb kids. with a knife. Please, I will not kill him. Release the hounds! Okay, we kill the dogs too. I saved your life. The Witcher wins! Yep, and I let him win. Born brawlers in battle! A fracas! A rumpus! A fray! The Witcher versus the hairy brothers straight from the wild isles of Skellige! Sired by a mountain bear! They live to kill! Oh, they're not you. He's fighting with me now. What the hell is going on? I'm going too fast. The Witcher doing what he does best. Face to face with beasts. Yeah, you made a mistake sending this video. Yeah, this is what I do best, as you know. Easy peasy. This is the troll. Shall I release Boris? Boris, 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 Boris. Especially for you, for the first time in a long time. Mm -hmm. Release Boris. Boris. Oh, it's a bear. Boris is he's not gonna die. Honestly, it's easy. Yet another win for the Witcher! You got more? You don't got more. Well, whatever. He's not here though. Right? Oh no, he's here. Bravo! Plowing scragged and furrow. Tell me a true bruise had come to the arena. Would you believe it? They were right. Uh, the thanks? Thanks. Cyprian Wiley, mm -hmm. known the most as Hall Son Jr., appreciates good handiwork. All right, well, here we go. We've not had enough. Now, nah. Cleaver's dwarves are in the sewers. They've slaughtered the guards. Don't stand there like a sodden prick at a wedding. Master the men and get out those magics. Oh, come someone, on. Please kill the blasted witcher. You're killing me? For what? What are you, you killing me for? Kill him. For what? I didn't do anything. The gangs of Novigrad, what? Ow, ow, ow. Yo, thank you, buddy, by the way. He's still helping me. Oh, he's, he's dead. Well, how long are you gonna make me wait? Come 
on. There you go. Slice your body in half. Igor's key. Have you killed Igor as well? Gangs or no regret? Just also the only the casino is left now. I guess we just we kind of had to fight through this. Meet Cleaver's dogs outside the arena. We didn't. <laughs> I just, I don't know what the hell is going on in this quest. It's it's a little messy. I'm not exactly sure what he exactly wanted me to do. Although I feel like I'm not really doing it the right way. There's nothing really going on here. And that fight was like super anticlimactic. You know, I would expect things to be worn by a moving door. Huh. Something behind this wall. Isn't there just a way out? There is, okay. Well first of all then. Yeah, we saw this. Search the secret stash. Vile, water, sheep skin, vile, vile, nothing good. Vento, four side, 60 crowns and a mysterious letter. Well, that's B. To Horse and Junior, King Radovid is unhappy with your performance. Okay, he's being financed by Radovid. You were to rid the city of the other members of the so called Big Four, yet only do they, yet not only do they still live, but they also now know of your role in their attempted assassination. This, this was not our arrangement. For the time being, hide in the place which the messenger delivering this missive will indicate to you and stay out of sight. His Majesty lives in the hope that mutual animosity between the other members of the Big Four will finish the job which you attempted, yet flubbed so badly. M. I if Dijkstra knows Junior's made a deal with the Redanians. Probably not. Got 7 XP for it too. And another 7 XP. And get Junior is updated. So the dwarves messed things up. Would they have messed things? I think they would have done it anyway. Whether I had, you know, spoken to them or made a deal with them or whatever or not. So you're fighting going on. I'm, I'm not to get involved apparently. I can just walk by. You guys are winning anyway, it's fine. I'll, I'll just collect the weapons once you're done. This is where I came from. I'll help you guys out. I guess Cleaver now owns all of this stuff. Oh, this is where the guy used to sit. Message from Igor and gold ring. Since there's been some misunderstanding lately about the valuables and a bit of blood's been spilled for no plowing reason whatsoever, I'd like to reassure you, all the coin is safe and sound in the lockbox. The blind arsehole who thought it was missing was looking at the wrong place. Walk down the corridor leading from the upper level toward the arena, turn your back to, to the grating and look to the wall opposite you. If you've eyes to see, you'll find what you're looking for. Let me emphasize that Horson Jr.'s crowns have not been touched, not a single cop is missing. I swear on my own handsome head that they're secure and waiting to be picked up. The coin safe and sound in the lockbox. The blind arsehole who thought it was missing will look in the wrong place. Walk down the corridor leading from the upper level towards the arena. Turn so your backs to the grating and look to the wall opposite you. Did I find this already? If you have eyes to see, you will find what you are looking for. Is it, did I already find this? You are in your kid's humble servant. Uh huh. Humble servant. Yeah, straight up a criminal. All these people ran away real quick. Anyway, I guess Cleaver's henchmen now own all this. So walk down the corridor 
leading towards whatever. I'm pretty sure I found it already. It was the box, right? Yeah, this is where I came in. Yeah. Let me just give it one last check before I end the episode. So walk down the way to the arena. Which is this way. Turn your back towards the grate and you'll see what there is to see. Is it just this? Or is there more coins somewhere? One second. Let me read that again. Seems there have been some misunderstanding lately about the valuables. Walk down the corridor leading from the upper level towards the arena. Turn your back so turn on your back to the grating and look to the wall opposite you. If you have ICC, you will find what looking for. Turn your backs to the grating. The gray or what is the grating? It could just be this could be the grating. Although this seems like gratings to me. I don't know what they mean. Is this supposed to be the grating? Is this no, this is probably the wall they mean? Because I don't see anything else with you and with Witcher senses, so. I think we found the thing we're supposed to find, which is that he's working with the Redanians, which then explains where he got all his money from. It's King Radovid, he wants to take out the big four and take control of the city. That was kind of like messed up what happened though it didn't really work out properly as we wanted you can meet cleavers dwarves outside the casino and these guys are over there and we have to kill them anyway to get in you might as well do it like this i don't know i'm not sure anyway i'll see you in the next one